Hey everybody, how's it going? Jade 55 here, and sorry I haven't been uploading any videos like this. I've just been watching E3, see Xbox, PlayStation, and just been watching a day after day one, day two. And so now, since it's all winding down, about to get to the end, I decided, like, you know, now would be a perfect time to make a video. And so here it is. So if you guys watch Microsoft E3, you will realize that they said um, Dead Rising 4 come up for the Xbox One and the and the um, PC and during the holidays, December 6th, I believe, or December 9th, one of those two days, I just said it on my Twitter. But then I realized, like, wait a minute, they didn't say exclusively to Xbox One and PC, like they, do, don't, like they normally do with every other video, just about. So I'm like, okay, so yeah, it's going to come out to the PS4, but when? When is it going to come out to the PS4? And I found out later today, it's going to come out a full year later. Yes, that's right. A full year, like full year later, it's like Rise of the Tomb Raider came out first for Xbox. Then, if you want to play it on a PlayStation, you gotta wait a full year. I do not. I don't understand why. I mean, we in a day, day of gaming where everything is gonna be a time exclusive or be an exclusive third party, all that stuff. But really, a full year later, this is Microsoft does it again. It's the second time they do this. What's the next game you're gonna do? Uh, actually, I don't even know what the next game is. I, I don't know. I can't really think of a next game. But probably like a sports game. Come on a full year later on PlayStation. I don't know. It's it's upsetting. Yes, I know PlayStation is did that with DLC for certain games, or maybe it's only maybe it's only like a certain DLC come out for PlayStation while Xbox didn't get any. Well, that's just DLC. But an actual full game, it won't come out for a year later. And what they're gonna charge full price? for on um, PlayStation that's just I, it's upsetting that it's getting to this point where it's like it's going to it's going to come out to where exclusive is, is this bad it's i don't understand why Capcom would agree to this what is it for the money you guys just really want that money Xbox probably paying you paying you that much but it's you guys are, uh, you probably need to understand you're, they're ruining the f the fan of Dead Rising community Capcom making Dead Rising 4 a one-year time exclusive would have been like somewhat okay if they said, "Oh, okay, for for having us only come out for Xbox One for the first year, we can sell it to you guys for about what is that, twenty dollars or thirty dollars with all the DLC and stuff." But more than likely, they probably won't, because I know Rise of Tomb Raiders they selling that game for what is that, forty dollars for the PS4. And I'm just like, why would I want to pay that much money for a game that's already has been out for over a year? It's just that's just that's just bad. I don't I don't want to do that. And now just made even think about like, okay, just get it on the PS, I mean Xbox One, or just you know wait for that price to drop to twenty dollars or less than twenty dollars. Because I'm not really that excited about Rise of the Tomb Raider. Same thing with Dead Rising. We got it's other there's other games coming out that's zombie related. Um, Killing Floor 2, and holy crap, I can't really remember any other zombie game right now, because there's so many games, oh yeah, um, Days Gone, which is not really, not really called zombies in that, in that game, called something else, I forgot the name, but still, there's other games coming out that will make up for the spot that Dead Rising refused to fill. About this whole, this time exclusive thing, I'm not really... Like that, that pissed off. I am pissed off, but not really that much, cause each console does have the exclusives and all that. But what's upsetting me is that it's gonna be a full year you gotta wait for a game to come on a different system. Come out on a different system. Like okay, you get you getting like Dead Rising already comes out on Xbox. Like okay, hey, you know sometimes they gotta do that. Sony does it too, but a full year that's just I, I don't know. That's just poking at the other fan base like okay get away a full year and you still got to pay us so much money while we just got to pay uh, for a cheap price of the game and get it earlier but that is my opinion about this guys we guys think about this you guys are happy you guys are happy that Dead Rising is only gonna show up for Xbox one the first year then PS4 you guys pissed off about it you don't care because Dead Rising is dead let me know what you guys think in the comment section below and I will be Finishing up the rest of my videos. I still gotta do the review for E3 for both conferences. Not Nintendo's because I don't really don't really like that many Nintendo games. 
and still gotta finish on mirrored edge probably the last part of it and still gotta finish until dawn but anyway guys they let me know guys in the comment section below like i said thank you guys for watching please like comment subscribe like me on facebook um follow me on twitter and subscribe that's all i gotta say so thank you guys for watching it again and until next time stay stay safe and happy gaming